Are you wondering how to schedule posts on LinkedIn? If so, you are in the right place because in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to do this. One of the latest features LinkedIn has released is that you can now schedule your posts directly within LinkedIn without actually having to use third-party providers as you needed before. So without any further ado, let me share my screen with you and show you how you can schedule your next post on LinkedIn. All right, so first things first, you're going to open up your LinkedIn profile and click start a post. What I want you to do right now is simply create a post you want to schedule. So whether it's a carousel or a video or whatever type of post you want to schedule, go ahead and write it and upload all the media. So in this example, I'm going to click add media and I'm going to add the quote post I have with Curtis, who was our latest podcast guest. And by the way, if you're intrigued how you can take your business from 3 million to 128 million in revenue in just five years, like Curtis did, I'm going to link that episode up here in the cards because it was an incredible story and just he is a great soul and you're going to be so hyped up to really 10x, 20x and 30x your business. So again, I'm going to link that above here in case you're interested. So right now, let me go ahead and show you how to actually schedule this post. So what I'm going to do right now is click next and then add a copy behind this post. So something to know about quote style posts is that you don't have to have a long copy behind them because typically most people are gonna read the text on top of your quote, on top of your image, rather than the text behind it. So it can be short and sweet. And now rather than hitting post, what we're gonna do is click schedule for later. And very quickly, we're gonna pick a date, let's say Tuesday, pick a time, I'm going to go for something like 5 p.m., which is morning in the US and evening here in Europe, and I'm gonna click next. And now very quickly, if I want to, I can still edit it, though you can see your post and then proceed to say schedule. Now, once we do this, our post has been scheduled and you know this because you're gonna get this notification in the lower left-hand side corner, which says view your post, or if you need to check your scheduled posts later on, you can actually go here again, start a post, schedule for later and see view all scheduled posts. And right now you can see I have two posts scheduled for later. And if I click within one, you can see, okay, so this is a post I have scheduled and I can either change the date or I can delete this post. However, unfortunately, currently you can't edit it anymore. So if you want to make any changes, you do have to delete it and re-upload it and reschedule it. So hopefully in the future, there will be the editing option too. So one more quick thing I want to show you is that you're going to get some notifications later on to remind you when your post goes live. So let me show you that right now. All right, so if I go to my notifications tab, I want you to pay attention to these two notifications over here. One says, reminder, your post is gonna go live in 24 hours. So just in case you forgot something is going live, you do get a reminder, which is very nice. And when it is actually live, you're gonna get another reminder saying, all right, your post is live and you can hop in there and start engaging with people in the comment section, which is incredibly important in the first hour after you publish something. So there you have it, my love. That is how you schedule your post on LinkedIn. And if you could do me a massive favor and hit that subscribe button down below, that would help me a lot because we have a massive goal of hitting 100K subscribers on YouTube by the end of 2024. And I definitely would appreciate your help with this. Now, if you're curious to learn more about content creation on LinkedIn, specifically how to create carousel posts known as document posts, I'm gonna link that video here up as well for you to watch next because that content type performs incredibly well on LinkedIn. So again, thank you so much for being here and I'm gonna see you in that next video. Bye.